Now it's time to wire the neck pickup, which is the yellow wire, and take the hot wire from the yellow wire and put that onto the left hand side contact point of that second pot. And I've just sort of bent that in there. We just need to put a bit of solder on that now to hold that in place. Don't forget to tin your wires. And there you go, that's the hot wire done. And again with the bare earth wire, this needs to go onto the top, <coughs> excuse me, onto the top of that second volume pot. So again, just scratch up that top. And then you probably actually cut a bit of that earth wire off so it's quite long. So I'm just going to cut that off there. Make it a bit neater. Then just heat up that solder. Put your earth wire in. And then down. And there you go. All right, so we've got our two pickups wired up now. We've got the uh, neck pickup, which is the red. Sorry, the bridge pickup, which is the red, coming to this first volume pot. And the neck pickup, which is the yellow, coming to the second. And we've got the hot wires wired to the input, which is on the left, and the earth wire onto the top. Now what we need to do is we need to connect these pickups to the uh, three-way switch, which is actually up here at the top of the guitar. And there you can see that's the back with the three-way switch. So we need to get some wires running from this control panel area up through the body of the guitar, through both the pickups and into this control panel for the three-way switch. So what we do is we need to grab another length of wire. We've got these long wires here. Doesn't matter which colour, there's a red and a yellow one there. I'll just pull one of those off. And I've got the red one now. There you go, and we just need to expose about five millimetres at both ends. So we've got something to uh, solder onto. So just with your pliers, very careful not to strip the, not to actually take the wire out. You just want to take the plastic coating off. And there you go. So there's the uh, wire there. So I'll just twist that round. So there you go, I've stripped both ends of the, that uh, red wire there. Now I can solder one end of this wire to the middle point of this uh, bridge volume pot. So the middle contact point from the volume pot, then I'll feed that through the top of the guitar. Okay, it's actually an orange wire. I said it was red before, but that's an orange wire that I've fed through the body of the guitar now. So it's going through this control panel, and it goes through the bridge pickup hole, through the neck pickup hole, and right up here into the top, into the neck, uh, sorry, into the three-way switch control panel cavity. And there you can see it's coming out here. So it's going all the way through the middle of the guitar. All right, so what we want to do, we want to solder one end of this to the middle contact point on the bridge volume pot. That's the bridge, uh, the pot with the red wire on it at the moment. So there it is there. So we'll come in for a look. So here, this is our uh, volume for our bridge pickup. So what we want to do is we want to take this orange wire that's coming out here and we want to solder that to this middle contact point. So I'll just put that in and I've tinned that wire. So I'll just bend that over that second contact point and I'll solder that onto there. And there you go. So there you go, that's our orange wire soldered there, and it's coming out through here at the top of the guitar, ready to be wired to the three-way switch. I'll just leave that out there for the minute. Now, we need to do the same for the other volume pot. So that's the neck volume pot. So we take another long wire, this is the yellow one this time, and we do the same. We take some wire, expose some wire at both ends, about five millimetres at both ends, and we'll solder one end to that middle point on that uh, neck volume pot, feed it through the guitar so it comes out into the control panel for the three-way switch. So we'll do that now. 
Alright, so I've got this uh, yellow wire attached to that middle contact point on the neck volume pot now. So that's the volume pots done for the time being. Um, so we've got a yellow wire coming from the middle contact point going through the body of the guitar out to the top to the three-way switch, which will go here. And the same, I've got an orange wire from the bridge volume pot from the middle contact through the body of the guitar out to the control panel for the three-way switch. So that's all done there. Okay, the first step in our tone pots, what we're going to do is we want to grab some of these short wires. We want to take off one of those. I'll take off this blue one here. And what we want to do is we want to trim and tin both ends of this wire. We want to solder one end, one end to the third, uh, to the far left contact point where the hot wire is soldered onto. That's onto the volume pot. So we're going to put two wires onto the one contact point. And one end there and then one end on the corresponding left hand side of the tone pot. Now that's actually the right hand side because this is actually turned round. These contact points are facing each other. So you can see that. So we're going from the left of the volume pot to the right of the volume pot but because it's turned around it actually appears left here so it's left to left. So we want one wire coming from there to here. So let's do that now. We'll trim and tin that wire and we'll solder it up and see how it looks. Okay, so I've got this blue wire. It's running from the left hand side uh, contact point on this volume pot, which is the bridge volume pot. And it's coming back to this left hand side contact point facing in on the tone, <coughs> on the bridge tone pot. So that's that one done. Now we need to repeat the same for the neck pickup. So we want to run from the left hand side of the neck pickup to this left hand point on the neck tone pot. So there you go, I've now soldered this green wire from the left hand side contact point on the neck volume pot and it's soldered here to the left hand side facing in on the neck tone pot. So now we need to make these tone pots, tone pots, and we do that by fixing these which are capacitors. These are the two little green things that are in your packet of screws. So these are capacitors. We need to put these onto the tone pots and that will make them tone pots. So what we need to do is we need to connect one leg to the middle contact point and one leg to the back of the pot. To do that we need to cut one leg about halfway along. So on the slightly longer leg we'll get our pliers and we'll cut that about halfway along so you end up with the capacitor looking like that. Now what we need to do is solder this capacitor onto the tone pot and we do that with the short leg soldered to this middle contact point and the long, long leg soldered to the top of the pot. Don't forget you need to scratch up the top of your pot before you put solder on there otherwise the solder is not going to stick. Alright there you go, you can see that I've soldered the short leg to the middle contact point and the long leg to the top of the uh, tone pot there. It doesn't matter if you have to cut a little bit of excess off that uh, longer leg. So that looks good. Now we just need to repeat that for the other tone knob, for the uh, neck tone knob. And there you go, that's the second capacitor onto that neck tone knob now. Alright, that's the capacitors done. Let's move on. Okay, so we've got our capacitors set up on our tone knobs. They can just sort of be sort of push down out of the way like so. That'll just get them out of the way while we work on the rest of our wiring. What we need to do now is to set up some earth wires. We need an earth wire running from both the volume pots, so the neck volume to the bridge volume, and we need the same on the tone pots as well. We need uh, an earth wire running from the bridge to the neck tone pots. So we need two short wires. Here I've got a, a grey one and a yellow one left over from our kit, so we just need to trim those ends, tin them, and then connect up those pots. So we'll do that and we'll have a look. Alright, so here I've got an earth wire running from this neck tone pot to the bridge tone pot. And I've got another grey wire here, so I can run that from the volume to the volume. So the neck volume to the bridge volume. And there you go, I've got this grey uh, gray wire running from the top of the neck volume pot to the top of the bridge volume pot. 
So that's the two pots earth there and the two tone pots earth there. Now there is one other earth wire we need to um, put on and that's the earth wire running from the neck volume pot up through the body of the guitar and earth uh, it's going to earth the three-way switch. So we need to solder one end here, uh, feed the wire through the body of the guitar up into the control panel for the three-way switch, which is here. So what I'll do, I might actually feed that wire in first. So I'll come in through the body of the guitar and we'll do that and we'll see how that looks. <laughs> 